you guys thought we were done with K-pop videos. You thought, oh, Robert's never going to do another K-pop video again. Well, I am here to prove you wrong. Robert Eddie K, best known for epic memes, weird songs, mess yourself, and videos about BTS, and then a bunch of other dope stuff. I'd whip out my lightsaber, but the batteries died, and now it's just a worthless pole. Just like my dick. <laughs> Homies, it's time to celebrate. This is the first K-pop video I've done in two years. Yes. And that's not too crazy, because I mean, like, I took, like, a year and a half break from YouTube. But we're doing K-pop stuff, you guys. We're doing some dips to get ready. We're talking B T S B T. <laughs> BTS, the biggest K-pop band in the world. Only because I made videos about them. <gasps> it is time for an all-new, classic, Robert IDK BTS video. You've been waiting your whole life for this. No, you haven't. I don't do these videos too, too often because not everyone on my channel is into K-pop, but some people are. You guys have no idea how many tweets I get tagged in of people saying that I introduced them to BTS, and now they're a huge BTS fan, and their profile picture is Jimin or V, and they're a super fan now because of me. They probably bought hundreds of dollars of BTS merch because of me. Have they bought hundreds of dollars of Robert Eddie K merch? Probably not. You know how that makes me feel? I bought BTS merch. I haven't bought Robert Eddie K merch. And that's because I get it for free because I make it. <laughs> if you want me to be one millionth as rich as BTS, uh, pick up some merch in the description below. Represent.com slash Robert Eddie K. I love you. All right, BuzzFeed. Answer 10 questions and we'll tell you which BTS member is your soulmate. Map of the soulmate, am I right? You could say that this quiz is a map of the soulmate. You know what I'm saying? It's too yellow. And I, I'm not ta saying that about BTS, I'm saying that about the classes. We're gonna do some quizzes today. This is a Robert IDK classic. I haven't done quizzes in so long. This used to be a thing I did on the channel and I haven't done it in forever, but we're coming back. We're gonna do a couple BTS quizzes and then we're gonna do a special quiz at the end, which is gonna be a surprise. So, so stick around until the end. You better, if you, I swear, if you guys skip ahead in the video, I will be so mad. And now everyone in the comments is gonna be like, oh, Robert says don't skip ahead in the video, so I did it anyway, because I'm so cool. Wow! You're not cool. You know who is cool? People who watch the video the whole way through and don't try to be cool by doing other stuff. This is the longest intro of my entire life. Answer ton questions and we'll tell you which BTS member is your soulmate. In the end, we love them all. <laughs> well, duh, of course, of course. L don't get it twisted. We love all those boys. We're gonna find out which BTS member we should s sleep with. <laughs> Who do I want it to be? Could it be RM with his dazzling height and excellent English skills? I love my height. Could it be Jungkook with his excellent voice like Justin Bieber. Could it be Suga with the epic rap battles of history? Who knows? We don't know the answer to that question, but we're about to find it out. Pick a music genre. Alternative. Is alternative really a genre? You can have alternative rock. You can have alternative cla- I don't think you can have alternative classical. Let's go. You know what? Let's meme it up. Is there any BTS member that likes country? I kind of doubt that, but we want to be cool. Rock is very underappreciated these days, so let's go with rock. What is your favorite food? I I have no is this an ice cream but what the heck is this what the heck are you eating dog i ate a bunch of fruit today so let's go fruit choose a movie what are they eating they're eating these ice cream bars who who on their team was like yo fam we got to do a new photo shoot ice cream bars <laughs> it's like when all time low did this banana photo shoot all time low bananas i'm not messing around you guys look at this they're in their underwear um, and then they're all eating bananas. This was like many years ago. Yo, I met Jack Barracat actually a few months ago at a party in LA. You know, just humble LA brags. Choose a movie. The Matrix, classic, classic movie. You are the one, Neo. Okay, I can't do it, but I like the movie, okay? The Notebook is pretty lit if you wanna cry. It's gonna be one of these two, The Matrix or The Notebook. Let's, uh... 
Okay, it was the notebook. People describe you as, okay, carefree, quiet, energetic, sassy. That, oh, that's me. <laughs> that's me, sisters. <laughs> Well, here's what I think I am. I'm a quiet genius, baby, yes! and I'm funny as heck. And I got that energy. I'm a little sassy sometimes. <laughs> um, and I care too much what people think. If 21 Pilots taught me anything, so we're gonna knock this one out. You know what? People have told me I'm quiet recently, and I'm not happy about it. Because I'm quiet around anyone who isn't my friend or my YouTube audience. You know what? I'm gonna have to go with quiet, sadly. Pick an ideal date. Ooh! BTS concert, is that in there? No, nope. amusement park, bowling, quiet night in. <laughs> Most of the time, quiet night in. I've gone on so many bowling dates, I can't even begin to quantify, uh, but it's not a good date, it's an easy, boring date. Bowling dates are bad because you j you're you never together at the same time. One of you is bowling and the other person's sitting back, then the other person goes and bowls and the other person's sitting back. Movie night, also a bad date because you can't talk. How do you learn about each other? Oh, a fancy dinner, mate. <laughs> go on a fancy dinner. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna go for the quiet night in, you guys. I'm gonna do it. Describe your sense of fashion. So you guys know me. I like to keep it comfy, judging on the sweatpants that I'm currently wearing. But I'm also chic. I don't know what, I have no idea what chic means. Let's go, oh, uh, I don't know. Cause I wear some skinny jeans and they are not comfy. Let me, actually they are comfy. Let's go comfy. What is your greatest strength? Bench press, baby. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna go with creativity. Pick a color. Ooh, black, pink. And I ain't talking the K-pop band. Also lit band. Listen, I wear so much black. This is actually like less black than I usually wear. We're gonna go black, homies. You can't live without food, air, this is the dumbest question I've ever seen. N literally none of us can live without air or food. If you say Wi-Fi, you are a millennial. F <laughs> if you pick Wi-Fi, you are a spoiled brat who doesn't understand the importance of air and food. Air is more important than any of this. You die after like three months of not eating food. You die within like two minutes of not having air. <laughs> I can't live without air, you guys. Air is the most important. Get out, come on, you know, come on. Okay, the results are in. That was the last question. We got, drum roll please. I'll do the drum roll, because I'm the only one here. I got sugar! Your soulmate is Nin Suga Yungi. Suga is a hardworking person with a lot of compassion and talent. That's right. He's honest and blunt and a little introverted. True, that is true. And that is true about me. But he has a very big heart. I like to think that if you're a Robert Eddie K viewer, you probably are kind of similar to, to this. Suga, I love Suga. He's lit, fam. He raps. He's a fast rapper. He can rap real fast and he keeps it lit and he keeps his Gucci bucket hat fitted like I tell you guys. I don't see enough people telling me that Suga is their, their bias, their favorite BTS member. I don't hear enough of that. I've always thought Suga deserved a little more love than he gets. So I'm happy about this. But don't eat too much Suga, you guys, because it's bad for your health. Okay, that was good. That was an epic quiz. Um, Let's do one more. On to quiz number two. Which BTS member will be your Valentine this year? Oh, it's all right. Valentine's Day already ended. Pick an item for breakfast in bed. Oh, yo. Yo, this is my kind of bro. This is my kind of quiz already. I love looking at things like this. Okay, don't eat just a croissant. That's all sugar. Okay, obviously I'm gonna pick the thing that has every option. This has toast, sausages, bacon, and eggs. Why would I just pick- Oh, this does have a little bit of everything, doesn't it? I'd say this is the closest thing to my breakfast. I also have coffee. If you just have coffee, that's not healthy either, you guys. You want something like this. I eat scrambled eggs every day of my life. I'm not kidding you. I make scrambled eggs every morning. If we ever hang out, I'm gonna make you some scrambled eggs that'll blow your mind. I've made scrambled eggs, like, thousands of times at this point. I'm pretty darn good at it. I'll show you! Pick your favorite BTS song out of these. Yo, if DNA isn't on here, okay, good. DNA, DNA, you guys. If you haven't heard my DNA cover, give it a listen. There's the video link, but then also check it out on Spotify, please. I need streams because I need to keep these lights on. It's not cheap to keep these lights on every day, you guys. So go and stream my music, please. And also go pick up merch because my lights, if you want the lights to stay on in my home, I need you to pick up the merch. 
DNA. Pick a Valentine's Day gift. Okay, teddy bear, kind of cute, but lame. Chocolate, it's so easy to mess that up. A puppy? Yo, if you get your girl a puppy for Valentine's Day, that's a little extra. A ring? Bruh. As if any of these gifts are on the same level. A teddy bear? Or a diamond ring? Or a living creature? What the heck? Let's go with the mixtape. Pick your favorite BTS solo. Solo record. <sighs> Yo, Euphoria is so tight. So is Singularity. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna go with Euphoria. I'm gonna go with Euphoria. You gotta do it. I covered Euphoria as well. Pick a movie to watch on Valentine's Day. Love Actually is good. The Notebook. Oh my gosh. Let's keep it. Let's keep it going with The Notebook. Pick one more BTS song you like from these. Yo, the first BTS song I ever heard was Not Today. So we're going with that. And lastly, pick your bias. You know what? We're staying loyal. If you've been watching my BTS videos for years, now we are gonna stay loyal to the one the only rm baby we're sticking with the homie i will never abandon you i will never abandon you your valentine's day this year will be kim namjoon rm okay 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 this okay i am a little bit upset before we talk about how happy we are with this answer it shouldn't have this question this question changes everything literally making you pick from the possible answers to influence influence your answer? That's nonsense. I think that's lame. Anyways, we got RM. RM, if you ever see this video, I don't want to be weird. I'm not going to do any crazy fanboy stuff around you. But if you want to hang out, that would be tight, man. I, it gets lonely over here in Los Angeles and Canada when I'm there. But you know what? We can hang out. We can sing karaoke together. Do some... You can show me some fast raps and I will pale in comparison to your fast raps. But that's cool. I'm happy with RM. I am very happy with that answer. One more quiz, you guys. This person said, how about quizzes about yourself in to see how much is accurate? LOL. That uh, sentence could have been written better, but we're gonna do it. <laughs> how well do you know Robert IDK? How well? How well do you know Robert IDK? Honestly, I want to find out. How well do you know Robert IDK? Right out the gate, we got a photo from 2017. Look at those hand veins. Oh my gosh. This is when I was really into bodybuilding. Look at those hand veins. What does the average person think when they see these veins? Okay, they're still kind of there, but not to the same extent. Oh my gosh. My first video is called Heyo, first video. Who did he meet and get a picture with at PAX 2017? Felix, Dan, Mark, or Sean? I know the answer to this one. I met my boy, Jack Septic Guy, which was freaking awesome. I miss that dude. I miss you, Sean. But that's the answer. What is his most popular video? This is an old quiz. My most popular video now is the Impossible Guess His Age Challenge, and then the Smasher Pass. But at the time, Septic Talk was my most popular video. Septic Talk! So we're gonna go with uh, Septic Talk. What is his current longest series? What 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 the heck does this mean? Um, I, we gotta just take a swing at it, I suppose. I, I it's gotta be one of these two. No music. What series? None of this is a series. Oh no! Oh no! Let's try. Let's try. Let's play. Cause I did a bunch of gaming videos before I started doing music. Uh, where is he from? Britain. Uh, Canada. That's me. Out of the following, what did he say was his favorite animal? Oh no. Oh no. Wolf, penguin, lion, iguana. Well, I have a wolf tattoo, so one might think that that's my fave. But I don't think that's the answer. What did I tell people was my favorite animal? I might try penguin, honestly. Let's try penguin. Which of the following YouTubers has he not mentioned whether or not he likes? Okay, this is from like 2016 or 2017. Who did I not mention at the, at the time? I'm gonna say Crank Gameplays, which is kind of ironic because me and Crank Gameplays are, you know, we hang out every now and then. Ethan, keep killing it. You rock, man. I think the answer is actually my boy Ethan here. Thanks for taking this quiz. Final question. What is his Twitter bio? What was it at the time? Uh, the, the It was YouTuber, musician, meme advocate. And I still am. This I don't think there's ever been a more accurate four words in my life about me. So are we going to get a hundred? Are we going to get a hundred or are we going to get not a hundred? 70 percent. 
What? Only seven out of ten? What did I get wrong? What what did I get wrong? I want to know the proper answers. What are what's the discussion? What are the questions here? Seven out of ten. Yo, you got the same as me, homie. What did I get wrong? Okay, okay. Here's. Uh, anyways, I guess I don't know myself that well after all. But that's okay because life is all about learning yourself, right? Isn't that what they what they say? Someone make a new quiz about me though cuz I want to do a 2020 robert.ek quiz, okay? So then then I can get it all right, maybe. But yeah, any quiz makers out there make something new and maybe I'll do it in a video, okay? But anyways, these were some quizzes. This was an old school robert.ek video if you ask me. Anyways, keep it lit, keep it epic, keep your Gucci bucket hat <laughs> Fitted. This is not my new outro, I promise. Anyways, if you're a K-pop fan and you're watching this video, it'd be fun if you stuck around and, you know, join the community. It would be a real good time. But anyways, until next time, guys, I love y'all so much. As always, thank you so much for watching and have a good one. <sighs>